Everybody wants to know how you charge with the Sporlo Smart Tool. Well, I'm going to show you how to do it. And I'm going to use a ream in my scrap pile. Because um, everybody knows how hard or difficult sometimes it is to put a, a, a hose on the ream valves. So let's open it up. First off, let's try to put one on. See if it how how good it fits. And it fits. It fits on the ream. What do you know about that? So let's uh take it off and show you how we charge with it. What fittings you can use. Um, you saw, as you saw, that's a little bit too long to put a shredder core remover on there. So what we're gonna do first, we'll go ahead and put a 90 degree fitting on there. Like so. Take a shredder core remover, like so. Stick it on. Take your smart tool. Like so. You can open that valve now. There you go. Go ahead and put the other one on it. There you go. And you just put your hose on it. Of course, you'll have to use a hose with a ball valve on it. Connect it to your tank there. But of course you wouldn't be using this tank, the recovery cylinder, to charge with. It was convenient for me to, to get a hold of, so, so I just grabbed it just to show. So that's how you charge a unit with the Spoiling Smart Tool. It takes a couple fittings. I got my 90 degree adapter with a ball valve. Got my Schrader core remover. And I got a hose with a ball valve. That's it. One hose, no wires. Nothing to trip over, nothing to tangle up. How could you ask for anything more?